may I? to make myself misunderstood. Mm, much more clever. In my experience, complete understanding leads to boredom. That is a very French point of view. I am French. I figured that out. I figured out you are American. Omaha, originally, then Trenton. My name's Gregory Fitzgerald. Paris, originally. Then Paris. I'm Madame Francesca. I know. The natural waistline bores you when you're putting all your money on the long look. <laughs> You think the American women will succumb? Certainly not. But I have to say something outrageous. Why? It is expected. Why do you make me so uncomfortable? Well, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. You stare. No, not stare. Search. And your eyes are very blue. And you have a face like a man. Why? Doesn't everybody? I mean men. Mm, no. No, men look like mice or bats or howls, and sometimes like boys, but only rarely, very, very rarely, like men, like you. You are married, of course? No. Divorced? No. Mm hmm. Arrangement? Well, you could say arrangements. Uh, not probably the way you mean, but certainly arrangements. Your fiancé. He's beautiful, I suppose. Of course, you know, I hate beautiful women. Just as I adore beautiful men, like you. You mind I say this? Well, not at all. As a matter of fact, I was a very beautiful baby, and I have a picture on a fur rug to prove it. Your fiancé, she would not mind if you show me that picture? No? My fiancé understands everything I do or say or think. Good. The front of the card, an invitation to my collection. The back of the card, my apartment in Paris. <laughs> 